like 5.30 a.m. We're going to Tecton. Spent about 30 minutes there yesterday, but we pulled out a 1906 Barber Dime and an old cufflink and some other little goodies. Now, if you guys haven't already followed me on Instagram, uh, there is a link in the description to the Instagram page for Swing for the Ring, and we're gonna see what we can find today. So you guys know we're not just hunting any sidewalk tear outs we're hunting sidewalk tear outs with turn of the century homes that have been built here in this old downtown area this is where you're going to find the goodies Looks like it's actually a play coin, which makes sense because it really wasn't giving a signal. We like to call that the eye track. Always be looking. It's treasure. We found the Barber Dime first during the sidewalk tear out hunt. It's a 1906, really in fantastic condition. Love the Barber coins. Today we pulled out two Indian head pennies. One is a 1895, the other 1893, but the front side is beat up. Also, we did find eight wheat cents the earliest 1918D, 
we have a tag of some sort. Not sure if it was a key tag, a hotel tag. Uh, there's a little marker on here, F33. I don't think that it's like a chauffeur's badge or a firefighter's badge. Uh, but if anybody has seen any of these, let me know what you guys think. Like I said, I think it might be like a hotel room key or a hotel badge or something like that. Maybe a bag tag for somebody. So this dime was kind of interesting. Uh, it has a weird little metallic look to it. And I actually found this in a sidewall just hanging out there. It looked like a silver coin, but it's plain money. We picked up a few little trinkets as well, a couple little pins. Uh, this one is a nice little guitar, or as I like to always say, the world's smallest violin. Uh, we've got this nice little pin here. It's a bit chipped up, a bit beat up and everything, but it's got the little blue turquoise style beads along the side. I found this separately from the cufflink. They're in two totally different areas. Uh, but we got this cufflink cleaned up, but you can see it has the matching turquoise as well uh, with a nice little gold plated patina on it. A couple other little <clears throat> buttons and badges. Uh, I kept this guy because I knew it had a design on it, but it was really, really beat up. It looks like it was some type of little pin or uh, possibly a little button, but it does have like a little star on it. Kind of like a little sheriff's button or something like that. Could be a blue jean button. We had a great little hunt at the sidewalk tear outs. Again, I always recommend carrying your detector with you and making sure you guys stop and hit those up when you can. We've got everything on the banister drying out, getting ready for next week. Hopefully we can get a bunch more hunts in. But in the meantime, we're going to go enjoy a little bit of lunch, maybe a little bike ride, get some yard work done. Remember guys, Keep swinging for the ring.